I'm Fox with D5 Severe Weather Center Meteorologist Alita Donnelly. We're going to see those skies clearing as we make our way through your Thursday evening. And with that, we will be seeing temperatures falling as we do move through the night. So temperatures, those are going to fall into the low 40s by the time we get to your Friday morning, which means you may want to grab those medium weight jackets as you get ready to head out the door. But we are expecting to see some partly sunny skies first thing in the morning. Then we're going to be seeing mostly sunny skies as we make our way throughout the rest of the days. We'll see temperatures warming up into the upper 50s. Now we are going to continue to see those winds coming out of the northwest and that's going to help keep those temperatures just a few degrees below average for this time of year as it is going to be a little bit cooler as we'll be seeing those winds gusting up to about 35 miles an hour and we're pretty much just going to see more of the same heading from Friday night into Saturday but cooler temperatures are expected as we start the weekend. So 42 year overnight low as we do make our way from Thursday night into Friday. Partly cloudy skies again not too breezy through the overnight hours but that is going to change as we make our way through the day. So at the bus stop tomorrow morning, we'll see a temperature of about 42 degrees first thing in the morning, sunny skies across the area. We'll see those winds picking up though by the time we get to around lunchtime on Friday, and we'll be seeing a temperature of about 57 degrees as the kids get ready to wrap up their day. So we will be seeing gusts up to about 30 miles an hour as we make our way through the afternoon and into the evening hours. Now with that, we will continue to see those winds coming out of the northwest, keeping those temperatures a little bit cooler throughout the day as we'll see a high temperature of about 58 degrees. Again, northwest winds are going to be breezy, so that's something to watch out for as you will need to keep those medium weight jackets close by throughout the entire day as we'll be seeing plenty of sunshine. Now you can always download our Fox 55 Severe Weather Center app on the App Store or the Google Play Store to have our latest forecast in your pocket.